right, so for this mini canvas, we're going to start by drawing our characters as a rough sketch. And I'm doing this because I don't want to do my final painting without knowing what I'm doing. So I can go into it kind of with a plan. As I was thinking about this project, I was trying to decide what would make this a very easy method to create a comic character onto a canvas. Okay, to make our mini canvas, we're gonna have a gesso board. I don't know if I said that right, but it's a small board. It's gonna look a little bit bigger than it actually is. We have the size exactly right, so we're going to transfer this onto the board. So I like how this is looking, but I think I'm going to change it just a little bit because it is so hot today. I'm going to do a theme based on summer, so. So one thing I want to mention briefly for anybody that's not familiar with this kind of paint, this gouache paint, is that if you put water in with the paint, it really helps keep it from drying out and it also makes it much more smooth to go on. So that's a little tip if you're not familiar with this kind of paint. It is a little trickier to use.
For this mini canvas, I thought it would be really fun to do a summer version of a picture that I would normally draw, adding some fun summer elements to the lettering and to the art itself, just to kind of give it like a vibe of hotter days, fun days, time out, just with your friends. What would you be doing as a kid in the 90s? What would you be enjoying? And of course, I had to add the quintessential iced coffee because I love iced coffee, but it was a fun idea when I thought about it. Just because it is summertime right now, as I'm recording this video, I thought just adding that little extra touch would make it all the more interesting. So what I'm aiming to do here is to make these letters look kind of like a watercolor. So I'm kind of interested in making this canvas because it reminds me of the comic books I made as a teenager. I made summer edition comic books and they were always super fun to do. And of course it's always fun to collect a specific issue of a comic book or something that is a little bit outside of the norm. So the goal here it ultimately is to get like a beachy looking summer feel for this particular canvas. And I'm doing that with using these very neutral colors. They don't actually, they're not super bright, bold colors, not really. The goal is to just kind of give it more of a pastel feeling. It's a very soothing thing to watch the ocean come in or to sit on the beach and watch the sunset. All you need is a canvas and some paint. And I always say that if you can't find something you want, make it yourself. I really think that that is the secret to life, to take your dreams and make them happen because no one but you can do that. Do you have the desire to create beautiful art and make it into something that's practical and valuable to you? Well, I did too, and that's why I started this channel, Sam and Jillian Comics. It's the perfect place for you if you like the idea of creating products that you can display in your home. It's so easy to do. I try to make things simple and fun. I invite you to join me in Sam and Jillian Comics. You won't regret it.